simulator thingy of theirs is supposed to be able to do anything, right? Why do they need more than one? Previously, each unit had a facility reserved for them alone, but as an energy saving measure, and in order. One at a time? Skates. Hmm. I kind of feel like just going there, but it's also really dang... Yeah, it's an area we've never been to before. Do I wrap around via the... Maybe over here somewhere? Hey, there's some kind of an, an item vendor around here? Oh, yes! We're back near the shores, and... Yeah, we saw a village here before, didn't we? Full-on village or just one dude? Gungaga port. Hi! Just you here? The GYC is in charge of tracking cargo. You. Got nothing but the best here. Oh, you're selling so many of those mushrooms. Oh, you don't really have anything I'm, I'm looking for, I think. Thank you, though. Thank you. I knew you had a keen eye. It's just a random port here? I guess so. Yeah, there's not much actual... Welcome to Gungaga Port. Seas as calm as ever today, which means smooth sailing. Lush green forests are great and all, but there's nothing more calming than the deep blue of the sea. I feel like this area is a bit remote for people to really come, though. They said earlier that they wanted to depend on tourism and all that. I'm not sure how well that's really gonna work out. Okay, I think the facility should be around here somewhere. This mushroom looks suspicious. Please be here. Make it easy for me, will you? Ah. Good. Excuse me. Thank you. Let's dispense with the formalities. For your next mission, you'll be my bodyguards. Oh. Oh. Not that I have need of any, but no matter how much I protest, this one never listens. Hostile forces have infiltrated Junon and disguised themselves as allies. We must take care to discern friend from foe <laughs> and ensure no harm comes to the president while waiting for helicopter extraction. Make us proud, trainee. Oh! Can I be a bad guy? Shall we? Sure. Just watch who you're shooting, okay? <laughs> Yuffie and Aerith, I don't have them in the same party right now. Yeah, I'll, I'll do Yuffie and Kate Sith, I think. It's kind of funny how they have- they apparently- this is a training scenario they had, but... It actually happened. And the president still almost got assassinated. Doesn't seem like their training's been working all that well. Enemy vanguards advancing on your position. Be ready to intercept. Okie dokie! Just oh, they're all blocking. I think it's fire, right? Oh, Grenadier is not assessed. I guess you should assess him first. Everyone is weak against fire? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Here we go. Yeah, good work, Yuffie. <laughs> Doing good here. You're gonna get what's coming to you. Oops. 
You are okay, that works. Run like a chocobo? I held them off for as long as I could, but there's just too many. Oh, They're all yours now. We have a bit of a time, a time factor here. That's okay. These guys are also. Oh, I guess we should assess them. Fire, 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 and then the the slug rays are thunder and wind. That's okay. We'll ignore them for now. Yeah, it seems to be working well. Oh, we gotta get close before we activate the art of war, though. You're gonna get what's coming to you. You. So the annoying thing about Yuffie is that if we do want to switch the element, it takes a little bit of a setup, right? Unless if I just cast a spell by itself. Oh no, Yuffie's been. Here we go. Come on, buddy. You all right, Yuffie? Buzz off. Looks like they're finally sending in the big guns. Be careful. Those guys mean business. We'll get there as fast as we can. Just try to hang on till then, okay? Just so much for your training. Your training doesn't even work that well. Have I not assessed any of these guys? Flame troopers? There's some... Yeah. I'm your one-stop clobbering I think Yuffie has the better assess. Yeah, it's fire, fire, fire. Oh, yes, 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 everybody. Cloud can do some stuff here as well. Kate, how you doing? Oh, that Moogle is just going all over the place. Oh! Okay, that Flame Trooper being kind of annoying here. Flame Trooper, you blindside. Launch an attack even while immobilized or reeling from damage. Okay. Oh, yeah. That actually worked out really great. Windstorm. For the slugs. At least put up a fight. Another one here. You're alive. Another worse for wear. This way. Mr. President. Right. They've committed to the, the role-playing aspect of the training scenario, huh? A stellar performance. You've earned a bonus. Hmm. Whatever you desire, just ask, and it's yours. A million gil. Mission complete. Our president is the heart of the company. He cannot be replaced. It is vital that we keep him from harm, even if it costs us our lives. Keep that in mind on future missions. This facility will enter power saving mode. Once you have retrieved your provisions, proceed to the next location. Sounds good to me. I have almost everything I need to restore the data. All right then, let's do it to it. The sooner we finish this thing, the sooner we can show them what we're really capable of. But I'm wondering if we're gonna see the samurai guy again. Because that's what the proto-relic stuff seems to be heading towards. Everything related to the samurai dude. Oh, that's near the airfield. Okay. Should I go there right now? It's quite far. It's quite far. Quite far. 
Oh, we can probably head over there. But before then, let me see if I can... Let's see here. There's a life spring here. Haven't done the snap yet. Yeah, if I can get this before we go there. Legend holds that each time Kujata appears before humans, it takes on a different form. It's been seen wreathed in raging flame, cloaked in chilling ice, and bathed in crackling lightning. For this reason, the people of Gungaga have worshipped it as an embodiment of nature itself for generations. What's the element on this one? I'm not even sure. Again, this is one of those places that you had to discover by jumping on the right mushroom. Good enough. We should probably get this one done before we get out of the region too. Otherwise, they'll start stacking up. I think we might know where the other one is already. The Divine Intel? That was perfect! Thanks to your hard work, I've obtained invaluable Divine Intel. I feel like I've been to a place nearby and then I saw some traces that are, there might have been a Divine Intel, but I didn't pursue it because I was trying to go to a tower or something. That's okay. Let me, let me figure out how to get to the Phenomenon, hopefully without activating the... Um, the main thingy, too. Oh! Alright, that's kind of cool. Oh, oh! Observation Tower. This is sort of a newish area. I've been trying to figure out how to wrap over there. Taking a little bit of effort, though. What kind of Observation Tower? Guess we'll find out. I feel like half the battle in this region is figuring out how to get to places we want to get to, as opposed to just doing the thing. <laughs> Anything up here? Nothing, really? Why the hell did I come up here then? There's gotta be something, right? What? Sending me in this tower for no reason. Not even a cash location, nothing? Okay. Oh, Red, it's okay, we don't have to climb anymore. We can go. Well, I think we're slowly getting there, although are we gonna get to the tower first or the phenomenon first? Seems like I might be up in the air right now and... What are you doing, little buddy? This'll be helpful. Hey! Please hold. <laughs> it's sort of casually clapping for me. Thank you, buddy. Okay. Yeah, there's some kind of a ruinsy thing going on here. If we keep going this way, we'll probably end up at maybe the tower. Oh, but can I even go down? That might be an issue. I don't see... Oh, I see the tower. Okay, but we're not coming down this way. This way? Going all the way around. It'll be worth it though, right? Yeah, let's hope so. Here we go. Of course, not without some annoying creatures first. Gungaga ruins. Oh. No weaknesses. 
How you like that? Here we go. With the power of his providence, want to beg for? Oh God. Oh no, they're like making babies and stuff. This is not good. We just triple slash everybody. Hope we get somewhere. What are they doing on the ground? They're doing some earthquakey stuff. Sorry, Junior. You gotta die today. Sorry. Gotcha. Ooh. And then what? Okay, we're at the base of the tower. We can't climb it. This is a pole for us to come down. But the way to get up to the top. Yes? Another stop? You better be leading me to the right place, I swear. You're just taking me everywhere. <laughs> okay, that's very nice, but not what I was looking for. Not what I was looking for. We got a... Oh, now we're kind of close to this too. This is the, the Sultan of Stench. Well, if we're kind of in the area already, I don't mind doing it. Although I feel like getting the tower first might have been um a better idea. It's okay, we'll, we'll figure it out. Scenic area. Somewhere over here. There you go. Guys, come over. We've never taken a, a group photo together. Do you guys want to take a group photo? Maybe. It's kind of hard when y'all just... Okay. <laughs> uh... I can't really go over there. I mean, I can, but it takes forever. Oh, th that's kind of scary. <laughs> okay. Sure. Whatever. Cool, so now we just gotta take this back to snaps. Scenery's nice. Mm hmm. Am I ready to fight someone right now? Not exact. I'm gonna switch back to Aerith and. Tifa, maybe. I don't think it's right here, but we do have that... You know, the, this thingy right here? Let's see what this is about. We don't know what kind of creature it is at all. Am I high level enough? This is it, Cloud. We've arrived at the Great Marlboro's Domain. I'm sure you've surmised from the aroma. Olfactory risk level high. We just have to defeat it. It is level 38. We are level 37. I think we should be fine. Yeah. What is it going to be weak against? Oh, gosh. Ooh. Oh my god, you're like a tripophobic nightmare. It's kind of gross to look at in general. Best do it right. Ice! Immune to like a million things. These grotesque fiends live in Gungaga's jungles and boast countless tentacles springing from their heads. From their giant maws, they spew corrosive liquid and most acrid of breath. Exposure to Mako has made them bigger, uglier, and stinkier. Shattering their mouth will make them susceptible to staggering and prevent them from using bad breath. If left unchecked, bad breath will steadily increase in potency. Its mouth will regenerate after a certain amount of time. Okay, ice, ice, ice. Deal with that. So it's my turn? Whoa, don't look here. I believe in you. How far? Whoa. 
Oh, I got toted. I got Seriously? Gotcha. I don't know if Tifa has ice. Oh, why does Tifa never have the right? <laughs> I never have the right stuff for her. Freeze. Is all it's on you. My turn. Aerith, you gotta come back, my girl, because I need you for all sorts of spell casting. Chill. Oh, that barely did anything, man. Calling ice. Woo! We can detotify, right? I think actually we have a. Pretty sure there's an item for that somewhere. Oh, don't, don't, don't turn! Don't look at me. I'm just gonna hang back a little bit here. Detotify. Detotify. Maiden's kiss. Steady now. Don't overdo it. Sure. Yeah. Okay. That's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, but she's still silenced right now. Okay. That's fine. We'll we'll start by casting the radiant ward. Don't worry. The plan. That's it. I think I'm. I'm poisoned as well. Wow. That bad breath is really potent. That's okay, I'll, I'll set up some stuff while waiting. Arcane Ward? One more shot. Let's get serious. This one's for and I can take some... Well, Tifa can heal me. Don't give up. Someone! Anyone! We need help! The silence is almost done. Okay, it's done. So now I'll just blizzard the heck out of here. Stagger? Oh no! Oh shoot, the breath! Oh shoot! Tifa, I'm sorry, girl! Firework blade? No. Gonna enjoy this. That was a bit of a waste of the stagger time. That's okay. Oh, there was a separate thing we could have aimed. Oh no! I think this might be it. Okay. I don't even know where Tifa is. She got That's taken it. in somewhere. I need to make sure I'm healed up. Maybe I'll just use a. No need to panic. Are you okay? That'll do. Make sure everyone's healed up. Maybe. Now. Oh, I thought that I had I thought I had the magnify on. Whoops. That's not good. Here it comes. Cloud, are you? Cloud is still a toad. I'm curious to see how much Aerith can do by herself though. <laughs> we'll see. Another. Oh god, oh god, oh god. No, it's probably better for me to However, I can help. Detodify. What? Give me back Tifa! Get him! That's it! Where did you even put Tifa? I don't know. Oh! Summoning Phoenix to help here? No, I, I should just probably Maiden's kiss this. Catch! You back? Oh, it's sitting Oh no! Oh no! Cloud sleeping. Aerith is Petrified. This is it's okay. Hang very on. bad. I'm wait. Oh my gosh! Wake up, Cloud! I can't do anything. I can't do anything. I just gotta sit here and wait. <gasps> this is so bad. Wow. Oh you wow. Hmm. Hmm. It just takes away some of my companions permanently. I think I just have to be careful about that, but we should be okay. Should we do some preventing toad items? We could do that. How many of those do we have? Yeah, we should have been able to do it, but the toad stuff sort of set us back quite a bit. Let's see. 
toad. Don't we have anything that... Grants toad at the start of battle. No! The opposite. The opposite. Immunity to silence. Okay, this one could be good. Psychic's charm. Immunity to sleep. Okay, that, it's better than nothing. Karmic Cowl. Immunity to slow and instant death. Okay, we'll just go in quickly and we'll get it over with, okay? How about that? Just be quick about it. Oh boy. Already as- Wait, I don't- I, I have to assess you again. It's on you. I'll show you what I can do. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go on. Don't come over here. Don't come over here. Oh god. Let's get away. Woo! I can't escape. Okay, thanks for the warning. Who's up for some magic? The ATB builds faster with Radiant Ward. I should have been using it a long time ago. Katifa's sort of right up in the face. I don't like that. Oh, I should have given her a um, materia or something. Hang back. Deal with that. Here goes. Shatter. Come on! Keep it up. Don't catch him. Get him. That'll do. Tentacle whirl. Tagging out. Let me handle this. Can you guys sort of draw the attention away? No more game. Watch yourself. Taking over. Putrid breath. Can you heal yourself? Feeling good. This one's for you. Synergy. Firework blade. Fetid mouth. Oh, we can break the mouth. Cloud. On it. Don't give up now, you guys. <laughs> Just the mouth. Oh no. So oh no. The cloud just left the party. Why don't you lead the All way? Set. Feeling chilly? Should we focus on Attack. the element Attack. here still? Cloud's gone so early. Can we do this? There. Come on. Uh. The stagger is building. Bingo. Heads up. You're up. Get I'm some coming. ATB. Build some ATB. Okay. Hold up. It's your turn now. Seizing the opening. Maybe star shower and then Lizard. Another. Another star shower. Just do it really quickly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. Taking much better advantage of the stagger this time. Cloud! Girls didn't need you. Whew. Oh, most of Your our party members. Was inspiring, Cloud. That malodorous monstrosity has been sent back to the jungle depths from whence it came. That's a considerably rare material, Cloud. I suspect it will prove useful in crafting new creations. I suggest you hold on to it. Most of our party members weren't even level 37. So I guess we were a, a teeny tiny bit underleveled for this. That's okay, we figured it out. Oh, but the way they just take away your party members is kind of unforgiving. It's just one and gone. Okay, Aerith. What did you have earlier? You can have a... Cetra Talisman. Certainly better than the Talisman of Focus. Should we do it like this? Fits you anyway. Max MP. This is pretty good too. Grants immunity to silence. That's really important for a spellcaster. 5%. Anyway, yeah, I think this is good. Whew! 
But that wasn't really what I came here for. I guess I should head back to the tower or something. Here we go! Just a straight-up slide over here. Nice. Ow! Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, chill. Just... Yes. Anything I haven't gotten already? Uh... Okay. Yeah, those are important eventually. In terms of trying to get to the proto-relic... Yeah, I still gotta figure out the path there. Yeah, I think we... That looks like a training facility to me. Little dude just led me to a... Bus stop? If we bounce over there, will it be what I'm looking for? Seems like it. Oh, uh, excuse me, I'm just sort of passing through, if you don't mind. Snuff out the rogue pair that betrayed our organization. What? Hmm? Two former Turks, Rude and Elena, have kidnapped the president whom they were tasked to protect. Oh. Traitors are to be afforded no mercy. Their lives are forfeit. Naturally, the two of them know Turks' policy and will fight to the death. Kill or be killed. These are the only possible outcomes of any confrontation. Here's hoping you survive. They're teaching you. But aren't they friends? How can they go from BFFs to shoot to kill just like that? Probably got to be pretty ruthless to make it as a Turk. You're comrades, but any moment you can stop being comrades. Okay, Aerith and Tifa. So we're fighting Elena and Rude then. Yeah, Aerith and Tifa. This is like the the Mithril Mines 2.0. You want a rematch? A training rematch? Do I have to assess you again? Wind and thunder. It's been a long time since you and I went head to head like this. You might think I don't remember all this shit you got. We'll get the kid first. But I never forget. Good thing too. Don't want to be a couple of pushovers. Kind of shaky. <laughs> the kids just screaming left and right. This one's tagging out. Okay, let's go. Don't worry. For once, Tifa does have this. The company forces us to do the dirty work. What are we getting to turn? All Shinra has to offer us is exhaustion and a one-way ticket to the life stream. To them, we're just tools to be used and abused. They're sucking the life out of us just like they're doing to the planet. Wait, I wasn't really paying attention to the stuff they were saying. Why would you say that? Don't you work? Hey, oh, man. I guess they're playing they're playing into their role again. Huh, they're really good at this role-playing stuff. Keep it together. I'll show you what I I just hate to have to humiliate you in combat. Get him! <laughs> Hold on. A triple shock wave. Rude. Too much? He's just doing nothing. Oh, okay. He just got interrupted, I guess. Someone looks kind Look of at shaky. Elena. That's it. Get him. Stop. Rude. Don't be a piece of garbage. Stay away from my ward. Why don't we just talk this out? Why don't you leave? Let me pull you. Could even call a avalanche. Turn it into a deep retreat. <clears throat> Obviously. Back off. Oh, that wasn't that great. Cloud, I'm sorry, I, I should have been making you do stuff. Here it comes. 
Hmm, should have done that earlier. Unlimited MP. Your root is being annoying over there. Copy. Well, don't say we didn't try to get you to defect peacefully. <laughs> Us Turks are trying not to give it to persuasion, which means... We're just gonna have to make you leave. Permanently. I guess this is goodbye, partner. Let's try to keep ourselves healed up a little bit. Hey, rude. Please stop being annoying. So it's my turn. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Elena's barreling over here. Another. Oh, rude shockwave. Hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa! Rude, rude's trying to get me. I don't have Kiraga here yet. You're still doing I got okay. Keep it up. Bring Try it. to keep up. Rogue stance. What is that? You ask for it. Gotta sting. Tifa's spell casting is not great. It doesn't seem to do too much damage. My turn. All right, kid. Time to go to hell. Brace yourself. Now we get Rude, who has been very rude the whole time. I'm not even gonna summon. Let's just try to get you. Oh, Cloud doesn't have wind. In that case, I'd like you to heal. I know you shouldn't be the healer, but I'd like you to heal us up a little bit too. I'm coming. Ain't dead yet. This one's for you. Don't, don't look at him. Just, just do our stuff. Synergy abilities, arrow, aurora. Relentless rush. On it. Nice. Are you inside the... Yeah, you gotta get back inside the arcane ward too. Not just the radiant ward. Gonna get win bonus. Someone looks kind of shaky. One more shot. Tifa! Keep going. Get him. You, go. you can keep doing it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we're just building it up. You'll be blown away. Stalwart stance. Enjoy the Oh, he's coming. He's Sorry I think he's that. coming. Or some Oh! Sorry, but I got lend me your strength. I don't think we even need that. Come on, team. Strike hard and fast. Get in there. Leave it to me. Get ready. Prime mode, haven't used these for a Here while, I huh? Gotcha. Bingo. 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 Bad it had been this, partner. <laughs> Get him. Deal with that. So it's my turn? <laughs> Just keep going with the arrow. There you go. Healing materia improved. Ice materia improved. All in a day's work. That was fun. Mission complete. Well done. You've proven yourselves to be born Turks. Wow, what an honor. We Turks fight as one, but our duty may require us to sever our binding ties. Which is precisely why. Oh. Who's there? Confirming person. Sisney? ID GAI 153. Affiliation. Oh. 
<laughs> Certainly didn't expect to run into you here. Took the words right out of my mouth. What in the hell are you doing here? Shinra sent me to inspect the facilities. Wanted to make sure they didn't have any unauthorized visitors wandering around. We were still working for Shinra? GAI-153. That's the identity we stole. Records indicate the individual with that ID underwent formal training. Wait, are you a Turk? <sighs> That'll be enough probing. For my benefit, but mainly for yours. <sighs> it was enough of a pain to cover up the mess you made at the reactor. Try not to cause any more trouble, okay? Sorry. Won't happen again. Anyway... I'm heading back to the village. Once you're done here, I suggest you make tracks. There's definitely more to her than meets the eye. She's cute. Hello. <laughs> you good? Hey, Chadley. What happened to the proto relic? Oh, forgive me. And there. So that was a nice little thing yeah, for you to find out that she's a Turk, I guess. It appears that by restoring the fragmented data, we were able to break the Proto Relic's encryption. Uh, translation? The potential applications are practically limitless. By converting matter into data distributed across a secure network, shielded from external interference, one could preserve said data indefinitely. So is it real? Like, can I touch it? Oh, of course. Behold, the proto relic in its restored glory. No samurai guy this time. Oh, we didn't touch it yet. Turks's proto relic. So that was like a nice little thing for you to find out that she, Sisney, is a Turk. Was a Turk. But it doesn't really mean too much in isolation though. Wish it, you know, came with a bit more. <laughs> At long last, the knave returns. Beneath the moonlight. In victory shall I revel, my Genji! Did it do? Did it, did it do? Did it do? Interloper! Chadley? <laughs> <laughs> None other. After analyzing the phenomena associated with your sudden disappearance, I was able to devise a way in which to join you virtually. He hacked the mainframe. Virtually. No matter! Be gone, foul conjurer, or I shall make this place your grave! Oh my! This is simply fascinating! <laughs> How many arms you got? I'm Chadley! You must tell me about yourself, and about this place! You dare demand answers of me? Such impudence! A rotten display of disrespect! Of wealth. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What did I say? Hey, Chadley's my boy. This will not stand. If anyone's gonna be killing him, it's me, not you. Back off. Chadley, you okay? I believe so. Yes. Tell me I didn't dream that shit. Correct. That was no dream, Cloud. You and I were there, together. Wherever there was, that is. I presume it was another dimension. Nothing's ever simple. <laughs> I sense exasperation. I, however, am emboldened to solve this mystery. I only hope that you will assist me in my quest for answers. Well, I'm curious what that samurai guy is all about. Yeah, I think we'll continue to pursue that line for sure. Turks' Proto Relic. Orb of Prayer Materia, level 3. Who has a Prayer Materia right now, actually? I'm kind of curious. Is it Aerith? We should be using that more. Yeah, hers is level 3 as well. Maybe give it to someone that. Give it to Barrett. 
just so he can heal. Oh, I haven't used this ATB thingy. Instead of healing, have a prayer? I guess we could do that. This is so close to Kiraga, though. No, I already put so much stuff on Barrett. Maybe let's put it on Kate Sith, make him a little bit more useful. Because I just threw in a whole bunch of his stuff here. Not useful stuff here. Bravery, faith. Nah, those are... Those are kind of like whatever for me. Prayer. Oh, Aerith has prayer as well, that's right. Okay. We good. Well, this means the proto-relic story is okay for now. Okay. I haven't forgotten about the... The weaponsmith has been waiting for a long, long time for us now. Maybe let's get back to him, huh? He's the last quest in this area that we know of for now. Maybe not the very last one, but he's... All the way over here. Someone lives all the way out here. In this wee hut. Uh, talk about rustic. Then again, a life without Marco. Uh, it's not without its charm, is it? In fact, mm. this could be a whole new string to the Shinra Resort's bow. Hey, the rural getaway. Cast off modernity and embrace eternity. You'd be surprised how many people would go for it. Could be a nice little earner. Oh, please don't even joke about that. Don't give them any more ideas. First, we exploit the planet for its Mako. Then, we exploit the fact that people have too much of it. And then, hey, maybe some of it, some of the people might not want it at all. Commercialize everything. Please, stop. Oh. Hello? Uh, damn it. Not again. After all that time and effort. Is it the design? Ugh. Not making any progress at all. Sorry I took so long to come here. You are the weaponsmith? Oh yeah, wow. Nice workshop. I'm just gonna casually take some of your stuff. Surely this isn't your very best. What you need? Mm, to hell with it. Back to square one. Huh? Who are you? Whatever, I don't have time to... <laughs> that arm! That magnificent arm! Uh... It is a weapon, but... How does it work? Uh... A universal adapter. Allowing you to switch out weapons at will. But look at all these scratches. Wait, have you been going around punching things with your attachments? Uh... Occasionally? Doing so ought to have given you multiple bone fractures. But this unique cylinder provides unparalleled shock absorption, allowing for high impact performance. Who made Who it? Was the genius that built this. Uh, an old friend, I guess. Don't know where he's at now, though. Uh, wait right there. <laughs> mm -hmm. Eureka! <laughs> Sorry, got carried away. My name's Izo. I've been trying to create the ultimate weapon, but my attempts have all failed miserably. But thanks to you, I finally made a breakthrough. I must harness the inspiration while I can. Please, help me build it. Gather the materials I need. What kind of weapon are you trying to make? Well, I never really thought about it, but Barrett's arm? I guess there's some... there's some complex stuff involved because it's probably connecting some nerves to the activation of the gun and all that. I wonder who did Dines then? You live here? I'm originally from Junon, but I could hardly breathe there, so I decided to leave it all behind. I wandered in search of somewhere I could build my weapons in peace, and eventually I wound up here. Not a bad place, huh? Of course, materials can be hard to come by when you live out here in the sticks. Well, you get access to other materials easier. Natural materials like trees, woods... So, about Barrett's arm? Though it seems crude at a glance, look close. The craftsmanship is remarkable. Whoever made it must have been a specialist in a completely different field. 
No mere weaponsmith would have been half as clever. The... What's this about the ultimate weapon you're trying to make? Indeed. I've made it my life's work. Frustrating though it's been. How to conceive a weapon I lack the vocabulary to describe. Well, we'll help you with it. Well, if all you need is some material, sure, why not? Just leave it to us. Wonderful, thank you! I believe I left a map in my storage shed that you can use to find what I need. Grab that before you head out, and you shouldn't have any trouble. You have a map, but you didn't go yourself? <laughs> okay, we're used to doing everything for everyone, I guess. Don't forget about that materials map I left in my storage shed. If you want to help me out, you'll need to know where to look. Hey, 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 attitude, okay? <laughs> At last! A breakthrough in my quest to build the ultimate weapon! I'm counting on you! Well, I'm expecting you to give me something back for this and not just money. Maybe I want some kind of a weapon upgrade too, if you're gonna put it that way. Nice workshop though. Very spacious and all that. Gotta say, never seen someone so interested in my arm. Most folks try their best to look the other way. He's a weird one. Huh. That's putting it mildly. Made me realize, too, how soft I've gotten. Because in the old days, I would have said no touching and decked his ass. In the old days? <laughs> Thank the brethren. It's the past, son. You say people look away? It makes me wonder why they look away. We um, sometimes people look away from things they're uncomfortable about, right? Like um, if people are disabled, they are missing a limb. So are they looking away because you're missing a limb, or are they looking away because you have a you have a gun arm and it looks scary? Probably the latter, which is a different kind of looking away from the first one. Here's a shed. Oh, you got a nice big place here. You just gotta organize everything. I'm stealing his stuff casually. Hey, why not, man? Draconite map. Collecting Draconite ore. Open the map Izo has provided and press... Uh, take a closer look. Follow his directions as best you can to find the necessary Draconite ore. Must be the map Izo was talking about. Don't know what else it'd be. Well, let's see where it takes us. You ready? Oh wow, it's like that? There's a stamp on the wall. Is it this building? How do we... Oh! Okay, looks like it's right here actually. That's pretty good. You're telling me the resource is right here and you didn't go pick it up yourself? Seriously? Wait, there's multiple... Oh, there's... Five notes! What? Are we supposed to follow them in order then, maybe? Okay, uh, well... You just want me to, like, go around here, basically. How will I know I found it? You better let me know. Here? This looks like something. Oh, yeah, maybe we're getting somewhere. Uh, the lighting on this picture is pretty bad. But maybe straight. Oh no, I'm not confident anymore. Oh, okay, okay, we're, we're getting somewhere. Ignore, ignore the people, the local residents, it's okay. It's fine. No, 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 we must get going. Thank you. We need to look for that little... Little rock. Oh, here's a little rock. Actually, a pretty big rock. You want me to go this way? And then there's a wall, there's some kind of like a ruins wall. Here. We want to climb the rope? Should be somewhere around here. Oh, that was kind of fun. Oh, no! Never mind! What are Guess you? 
Dagger wing. This is new. Ow, 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 ow. I got your number. Avian creatures that nest in forested regions. They boast electrified wings gathering eons from the atmosphere while flying to call down lightning. Wind, 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 wind. Ow, ow, ow. Hey, 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 get here. I can't get it. Oh, shoot, I forgot Cloud, is, Cloud doesn't have wind right now. I gotta give him back that materia. Somewhere. How now? Fortunately, that still works pretty well. And that's why we have those elemental things, huh? Wait, I need A. You're done. Yeah, go look at A. Can we do it on A? Did we get it? I can't even see. I think we got it. Gotcha. Deal with that. Here goes. We can do some... One more shot. Who's up for some magic? Ward stuff? Maybe not quite necessary for a, an encounter like this, but it's always fun to set up. It does take a while, but it's fun. It does eventually get to be fun. Watch out for her. You okay? Hey, no! Took away that second. Hey, no. No. Pressure that damn thing. Do we have synergy abilities? I don't think we need it. We'll it it's quick. okay. Lend me your strength. But the the healing That's wouldn't it. be bad. Let the winds caress you. Bring it. Nice. You'll be blown. Another. Someone looks kind of shaky. Yeah. Are we not right in that in the middle of that Enjoy arcane that. ward? You okay? <laughs> I am on fire today. I've been oh, sorry, Barrett. I know. <laughs> but you've always come through for me. Thanks, buddy. Don't know where I'd be without you. Sorry, man. I should have given you the spotlight by letting you. You know what? Yeah, yeah. Let's do that. So, Draconite. Draconite up here? Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no. It's right here. It's that very weirdly colored. That's like a. Seems like such a weird color Still to find in nature. Find. It looks kind of fake. Because I guess I have some expectations for what color things are supposed to be in nature. And this one looks like an artificial dye job. Which I, you know, it's probably not true. These are just assumptions that are wrong. <laughs> uh, probably more up here, I guess. We need to find eight. We have two. Although it looked like there was some sanctuary thing around here. Maybe I've done it already, maybe I haven't. Oh, there's some... some there. Just pick it up. With your bare hands, put it in your back pocket. Hunk. Hunk of Draconite Ore. Yeah. Six. Seven. And then... Eight. Hold up. Is that everything? It is. Let's head back and check in with Iso. Good idea. I'm just curious here. Oh yeah, that's one we went to already. That's okay. Yeah, okay. We'll go back. Hey, man! That wasn't so bad, but I guess maybe... Well, living out here, I feel like you should be able to deal with the monsters on your own, too. Especially being a weaponsmith, but anyway, I got you your stuff. Oh! Did you find everything? Yes! <sighs> Excellent! It's all here! Thanks! If you're not in a rush, wait here while I finish up. <laughs> I get that it's your profession, but do you actually enjoy this? Making weapons? 
Of course I enjoy it. That's why I chose this job. Besides, it's the wielder who dictates the true value of a tool. Weapons, too. Aye, that's especially true for weapons. Hmm. Hmm. Yes, yes, I've done it! Feast your eyes on my masterpiece! My gift to you, I insist. Oh, I it is any warm. Gentlest owner, you know. <laughs> Use her as you like. The wielder dictates the value of the tool, remember? And by association, the value of the maker. Therefore, what good I put out into the world depends on who I entrust with my weapons. And that's how I choose to see my part in it all. Hmm. Huh. Hell of a lot of pressure to put on some guy you just met, don't you think? The adapter that your friend made. It's a gift in more ways than you know. He was thinking of your future, of what you might do after the dust settles. Today, you may have no choice but to wield a weapon. But tomorrow, years from now, think about it if you haven't. The man who fashioned your adapter is an inspiration in his own right. And that's no lie. <laughs> You're pretty impressive yourself. Figured out how to adapt to the adapter. <laughs> Maybe one day you'll ask me to turn your arm into a giant egg beater. Fafnir I'll rifle. Make it so you can whip up a cake to serve a hundred. <laughs> Weird time to be joking around, man. Not joking in the least. That's the price for my masterpiece. You owe me a cake fit for a king. So don't you go dying on me. You hear? Yeah. Of course Barrett can't die. He has to go back to Marlene. We have to. Talk about a weirdo. Friendly, though. True. A weirdo with the heart of gold. We even got a free arm out of it, so pretty good, I'd say. The way... the, the stuff he talked about with the value of the, the maker being dictated by the, the weapon he created, like that's a very nice and positive way to look at it. Although when I think of like a weapon maker, I feel like I'm more personally inclined to think more negative. Like... Weapons are used to hurt people. And so is I feel like there's some level of um ethical dilemma there because yes, we s yeah, guns don't hurt people. Uh, people hurt people. Yes. But guns make it easier for people to hurt people. And you know, if you're a weapon maker, then you're sort of complicit in that whole cycle there, so eh. But maybe that's that's overthinking it way too much. Enhance overcharge, it increases overcharge damage by 15%. We can start with that every battle with Barret. Magic guard, attack power. Increases over overcharge reload when staggering enemies. Limit break. Ah, just just do some yeah, simple stuff. Fire, lightning, ATB stagger. Fire, lightning, do you want wind? Do you want wind, Barret? Everyone else. Oh, we don't have a another wind material. That's okay. You can do like a just have some material I'll never use. Level boost? I don't have any linked slots. No linked slots means nothing for the blue. We can't really use the blue. Eh. More HP is always good. Okay, so this one, the proficiency bonus is finish off an enemy. Ostentatious firearm crafted by a reclusive weaponsmith. Consume all ATB charges to deliver a close range attack. Oh, kind of like Maximum Fury. Consume all charges. Okay, and Red. Red is still waiting on doing th this one, too. Activate when the Vengeance Gauge is full. Okay. Oh, that's a... Yeah, we need to work on that. 